Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showing you on how to make this invisible chest try hard outfit. And it does stick. This is the latest version, the 1.50. And it is solo. And hit that subscribe button. What are you doing? Getting good luck tomorrow and the rest of the week. Join the family. Let's not waste any more time. And let's get straight into the video. Okay, guys. So in order to get black joggers, you will need an MOC. And if you do not have an MOC, just uh, tell a friend you could uh, always use MOC to start up the job to get the black joggers. So basically just load into an invite only or a public. It doesn't matter which uh, online server you do hop into. You will need to register as CEO and call up a mobile operation center or MOC. So after you've done that, you will need to enter the cab of the mobile operation center, continue to walk in and go to, to this little touch screen, little device inside of the mobile operation. Go to login, scroll all the way down and start up the job called work dispute. Once you launch that guys, you're going to enter the mission. And on this part, put the difficulty on easy. Put confirm setting and invite a random or a friend. It doesn't matter. So basically, guys, they could be AFK during the mission. So make sure you have the difficulty on easy. So I invited my friend. And also, guys, if you want to get black joggers, black joggers, you do have to be the first person. So I'm the host, right? And I'm going to be getting the black joggers. If you do need black joggers, you can always be the third player. The third player also gets black joggers. So... Once you do start up the job, you're basically going to fly out of the plane, both of y'all, and you're make you're going to make your way to your apartment. So guys, make sure you do know where your apartment is located because sometimes, the majority of the time, the house icon does not pop up on the map. Yes, so make sure you do know where your house is at. I know where my house is at because it's the Eclipse Tower. It's like just... The obvious one where it's at so guys once you do locate your house make your way towards your house and basically you see this blue marker this little blue icon basically pull up an rpg and you're basically going to kill yourself inside of the blue marker so aim straight directly into the blue marker kill yourself with an rpg or sticky bomb so once you've done that you're going to spawn after you kill yourself right you're just going to make your way back into the blue marker. So once you do enter the blue marker, it's going to let you have access into your house. So once you do enter your house, go to your closet and basically mess with the shoes. So go to the shoes and just put any shoes and save this as an outfit. It doesn't matter which shoes, um, just put any shoes. Once you've done that, save this as an outfit at least one time or two times. On this next step, guys, after you've done save this as an outfit one time, back out from the closet, open up your pause menu, go to online and put find new session. So go to online and scroll all the way down and put find new session. Once you've done that, it's going to put you in a new session and you should have the black joggers like this. If you've done everything correctly, you should have the black joggers. Okay, guys, so once you do load in, make your way to any clothing store on the map. So once you're there, go to the top section, go to t-shirts and find the crew t-shirt. So it doesn't matter which color it is, just purchase the crew t-shirt. So yours might be blue, black, or yellow. It doesn't matter. Just go to the crew t-shirt and purchase it. So after you purchase it, go to overcoats on the top section. So go to overcoats and you're going to need to purchase a red overcoat. So the red overcoat you do want to purchase, it is called the red clothes parka. It is called the red clothes parka. This red one. So purchase this. And after you do purchases, back out from the top section menu, open up your interaction menu, go to style, scroll all the way down. So you see jacket, 
make sure the jacket option is on open so just push right on the d-pad or left on the d-pad and open the jacket like this you want it to be open so the glitch could work so once you've done that make your way to the accessories go to gloves scroll all the way down and buy black tactical gloves so after you buy black tactical gloves make your way over to the shoe section we're going to need to purchase some fresh shoes okay so once you're at the shoe section guys go to sports shoes continue going down and you're going to need to purchase all white sport shoes these so after you purchase those make your way to the front counter and you're going to need to save this as an outfit save this at least one time on this next part guys go to outfits once you go to outfits you will need to find the highest coveralls it is called the heist coveralls so scroll all the way down and purchase the yellow hazard make sure it is the yellow one it only works with the yellow one so purchase the hazard one so after you purchase that one make your way near the pier so we could do a telescope so we could do a telescope glitch it's really easy so guys once you're there you're going to spam right on the d-pad near the telescope pull away from the telescope and your mask should disappear like this once you got the glitch to work so once you got the glitch to work open up your interaction menu, go to style and equip the outfit we made at the clothing store apply that outfit one time back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and the gas mask should appear like this so once you got the glitch to work correctly like this make your way over to the mask store so once you're at the mask store guys you're basically going to save this as an outfit one time once you're done save this as an outfit one time back out from the mask store and basically you're going to apply that outfit we just saved at the mask store so guys you once we apply the saved outfit at the bottom right of the screen there's going to be a little orange loading screen so it saves like this so open up your interaction menu go to style and spam the outfit we saved at least four times and at the bottom right you're going to see an orange loading screen basically it's saying that you did save this as an outfit correctly so once you've done that go to online go to jobs go to rockstar created go all the way down to missions and start up a titan of a job once you do start it up you would need no one you could do this solo guys you don't need anybody so once you're on the job menu part just go all the way to confirm settings and start up the job you can do this solo launch the job accept the alert and you're going to load into the mission and once you do load into the mission you're going to see your character have an invisible torso like this so turn around and your character should have an invisible torso like this but do not end the video yet we still need to do a few more things so make your way to the ammunition store doesn't matter which one you go to just make your way there so once you're there save this as an outfit at least two times make sure you save it two times and make sure it is not named something crazy just name it like a regular name once you did save this as an outfit guys basically we're going to quit out the mission so open up your phone go to jobs list and quit out the jobs through the phone do not quit out through the pause menu quit out through the phone so once you quit out through the phone you're going to load into the session and your character should look like this an invisible torso now make your way to the master so once you're at the master guys go to crime go to the crime section and you're going to need to purchase the black stars and stripes t-shirt purchase this save this as an outfit one time and once you're done save this as an outfit one time you're going to need to purchase a combat helmet so still stay at the mask store do not go nowhere so once you're done save this as an outfit go to the combat helmet section so go to the hats where these hats are go to the combat helmets and you're going to need to purchase a quad lens so go to the black and red quad lens purchase it back out from the mask store apply the save outfit we just made and make your way over to the telescope so we can do the telescope glitch so once you're near the telescope guys it's really easy so basically you're just going to run past the telescope push right on the d-pad pull away from the telescope once you got the glitch correctly to work your mask should disappear off your character and that's when you open up your interaction menu 
So like this, my mask disappear, right? Once it disappears, open up your interaction menu, go to style, and go to accessories and cycle through the helmets till you find the black and red call lens we purchased at the mask store. So after you've done that, back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and your mask should be underneath your helmet like this. Bam! So basically, you're just going to make your way to the mask store and save this as an outfit at least two times, I recommend. And guys, when you save this as an outfit, I recommend saving this as like a regular name. Don't name it like a glitch name. Once you did save this as an outfit, basically guys, it is sticks. It does not go away. The invisible torso does stick. That's what's cool about this glitch and it is solo. It's really, really amazing. And also guys, there is a new update. So every Thursday, there is a new update. So new sales and new things. So let's talk about them. There is three times double money and are pre on deadline adversary modes and business battles also there is a premium race called down the drain there is a new time trial called fort san kudo and a new rc time trial called construction site there is 40 percent off the biker businesses and plus the upgrades on the biker businesses also there is 35 percent off the mc clubhouse's custom bike shop so if you need uh, like the workshop inside of the MC Clubhouse, it is 35% off. I recommend getting it, definitely. Also, there is 40% off the Locust, so it is 975000 Also, the Rapid Rocket, it is 634000 And also, guys, if you do not own a presser, and if you have money saved up, I recommend buying it right now because there is 30% off the Oppressor MK2. Okay guys, I do have some links down below in the description. I recommend checking them out because I do have social media pages. I'm very active on those. And if you do need help on like a glitch, I can answer them like right away because I'm very active. And if you want to join my Discord, I recommend uh, joining in. It's really amazing. Everyone's helpful and it's very peaceful. All right, guys, I appreciate every single one of y'all. And hopefully y'all did enjoy. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And comment below what you think about this outfit. But yeah, guys. Catch you on the next GTA 5 online video. Peace.